the first and most important step in diagnosing a head and neck cancer is to have a history performed and an examination by an experienced consultant. After this assessment, the patient will move forward onto diagnostic tests in the clinic, which includes an endoscopy and usually an ultrasound scan and a needle biopsy. This can usually be performed during the same appointment. After that, if we have a biopsy that shows, unfortunately, the presence of abnormal cells, the patient will then proceed to a different kind of test, usually an MRI scan, possibly a CT scan, or other different complex tests, such as a PET CT scan, depending on the likely diagnosis and the primary site of the disease. After that, patients are then discussed in a multidisciplinary environment, which includes surgeons, oncologists, specialist nurses and pathologists, and the diagnosis is then confirmed. A treatment is then offered to the patient, which is right for them. It's very individualized, and each patient's particular features are taken into account. The diagnosis and the plan is then discussed with the patient, and then treatment is started as soon as possible.